the RA value on the surface finish for these parts is 0.4 to 0.8 microns on the top and bottom layer. 0.4 to 0.8 mi Wait, 0.4 microns? Yeah. Gee whiz. All right, guys, we're here today at Boston Microfabrication, and they do ultra precision, very, very, very tiny parts for extremely special applications. But I just wanted to show this out because most people have never even seen this kind of work. We've got incredibly tiny parts. So we're gonna to talk to EJ today and find out a little bit more about how this stuff is made, how the technology works, and how it might apply to you. So, EJ, welcome. Hello. Ah, so Boston Microfabrication, how would you describe, what do you guys do? So we make, manufacture, and sell micro precision 3D printers. So our goal is we produce highly accurate, highly precise 3D printed parts, but we're in that micron scale. So if you have parts that are four inches or smaller, but the key is you have micron level features, then we're the company that you have to work with. We produce stuff that is, has tolerances anywhere from plus or minus five to 25 microns on your feature size. Five micron, I mean, that's, that's, I mean, in 3D printing, about the lowest you go in FDM is 50 microns. So we're right. talking way lower than that. And this is our tolerance that we're talking right. about. What we do that's different is we dial in all of our precise focal points on our system. So on a typical thousand dollar solution, you're gonna have one flash for every build layer. Right. So what that means is if that's a 35 micron printer, in that small focal point of that maybe five inch build envelope, you're gonna get true 35 micron resolution. But the further and further away you stray from that, yeah. the less distorted, I mean the more distorted and the less accurate that's going to be. You might be at 40, right. 50 microns at the other end. With our solution, end to end, corner to corner, anywhere you are, it's the same true 10 micron resolution. Wow. So you picked out a couple of cool parts to show off. Yeah, so uh, clearly yeah. electrical connectors um, are by far probably our largest industry yeah. right now. See that one? We're capable of producing anywhere, depending upon the system, anywhere from hundreds to thousands of those at a time on a build envelope. Oh, 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 oh. Right? On one machine? On one machine. Oh, wow. Yeah. How big is that? I mean, is that like, I mean, these are pretty small, but is that like? So that, that system is what we call a bench top system. It's about 28 inches cube, but it has to sit on an anti-vibration table. Oh, yeah. Right? In order to get this accuracy and yeah. precision, you can't have people walking around and fork trucks knocking things all over right. the place. So that has to sit there to be highly accurate and highly precise. Got it. And our surface finish, the RA value on the surface finish for these parts is 0.4 to 0.8 microns on the top and bottom layer. 0.4 to 0.8 mi... Wait, 0.4 microns? Yeah. Gee whiz. What else and you then got? another application that we get more inquiries on than anything is microfluidics. Microfluidics. So this part right here pretty much tells the story of our technology. It has 18 micron channels that you can pass any type of fluid through. What, what does somebody use this for? All oh, life sciences. Life science. Pharma. I know there's uh, chemical reactors and stuff on yep. a super, I mean, small and big scale, yep. but they use all the channels to mix things really precisely, right? Yep. Dude. So yeah, that right there is a part that just uh, yeah. turns a lot of heads. Incredible. And this is so this is basically an, it's a liquid resin process. Yep. That's just really really accurate on yep. a whole nother level. Yeah, because we have like I talked about earlier, we have these multiple exposure zones per layer. So we dial in that precision and that accuracy. So we're we're projecting with either two micron, ten micron, or twenty five micron pixels. Awesome. that are coming down to project to get this type of accuracy. Wild. Out of curiosity, what do your systems run uh, for budget, like a range, yeah. give me a range? Any, a start at about 110, uh -huh. and you can go up to about 340,000. Sweet, all right. Yep. All right, guys, that's Boston Microfabrication here at AMUG 2023. We're going to be bringing you a lot more content from the show this year, so make sure you subscribe, like, and leave a comment down below if you enjoyed it. If you want to learn more, go to bmf3d.com or reach out to us at Vision Miner where we got all your 3D printing and 3D scanning needs. Anyway, thank you, EJ. Thank you so much, and we'll no see problem. you around. Thanks, guys. Cheers.